In the European Union, only nine countries haven't joined the Eurozone. In the past, Denmark and Sweden have held referendums, ensuring they did not join the Eurozone. As for the UK, they will still keep using their currency pound. Poland is the largest economy in Eastern Europe. When facing the Greek financial crisis, Poland's Prime Minister Ewa Kopacz stated that she has never said she would adopt the euro. Not today, not tomorrow, not in five years. She said she will not introduce the euro until it benefits Poland. According to Eurobarometer survey, a relative majority of people in non-eurozone countries have the same opinion. 42% want the euro to be introduced as late as possible. 63% of people think introducing the euro will cause prices to rise. In a monetary union, eurozone governments cannot make changes to the unified monetary policy to save their market, which becomes a problem when facing financial crisis. Should the euro be introduced or not? Well, the public opinion is divided. Countries with the majority against the idea include Poland, Sweden, and the Czech Republic. Countries with the majority wanting to introduce the euro include Romania, Hungary, Bulgaria, and Croatia. But in the countries that want to adopt the euro, over 50% of people think it will be introduced only after 2019. All in all, only 17% of people think that their country is ready to introduce the euro right now. After the Greek financial crisis, do people still want to join the eurozone? Well, maybe if they are prepared to face the consequences.